Hi, I'm Ashley. And I'm Katie. Welcome to Create Full Art. Today we're going to... What are we going to do? We're going to draw the Shopkin Strawberry Kiss. Strawberry Kisses. Okay, we would love for you to create more stuff with us. So be sure to subscribe and let's start creating the Shopkin. So the first thing we're going to do is we need to find something to draw with. So go find a marker or a pencil or a colored pencil and then you're going to make your first line. Are you ready for your first line? Yes. Okay. It is rounded. Basically. And it comes up kind of like a strawberry. So see I kind of have a little bit of a point down there. But it doesn't have to be perfect. Okay. Now. The next step is her lips, okay? Her lips are on the lower part of this circle and they're pointy. Oh, I burned myself. Okay, so it's like mm, pointy, pointy, mm. So kind of like an M. So the next shape, let's follow along with me, is a U that goes like that, okay? And then there's a line that goes in between those to the other side. Okay, perfect. And then I like to draw little lines on the side to make it look like she's puckering up. The next thing we're going to draw is her hands. So it starts about right here and it's just a line. Comes down and points back up and comes down and then is on the side of her like that. And then I'm going to draw a line right there. So it looks like a little leaf. Okay. Then on this other side, about the same sp spot to start right there. Okay. I'm going to go out and then point and then come back in. And then I'm going to give it a line right here and a line right here. Now we're going to move on to her shoes. I'm going to make her shoes green actually. Or red. It doesn't matter. But I'm going to make hers green. So you're going to start with a round top. Okay. And another round top next to that one. And then I'm going to draw a straight line on the bottom and a straight line on the bottom. She has hearts on her shoe, so I'm going to draw a heart in her shoe. I mean, on her shoe. <laughs> I'm going to draw a heart in her shoe. All right, and then a line at the bottom. Okay, and everybody's drawing is going to look different, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm there's two different it. eyes that we can draw. We can draw a round eye that's open, which is a circle don't want that to bleed. Okay, which is going to be a circle or we can draw to make it easy just a slanted line like this with a point up. Okay, so go ahead and draw a slanted line with the point up. Okay, perfect. Okay, and I'm going to show you how to do the open eye. So it's still low on here. It's a circle and then another circle about the same size. Okay. And then it's a circle right here at the top right. And the same thing, circle right here at the top right. And then there's actually another little circle that goes right there and goes right there. Kind of like a half circle. Right. Okay. And then what you can do is you can color this in with your black and give her eyelashes point here, point here, point down, point down, point down, point down. Okay? And then eyebrows. I like to give her eyebrows and a little nose like that. Oh, I kind of want it like that. All right. Can I do mine upside down? You certainly can do it however you want. Okay, so 
So now we're going to draw the flowers first because the leaves are kind of behind the flowers. So we're going to do that first. Yay! Okay. So you are going to just do yours with black. I'm going to do the center of my flowers first. There's a center right there, the center right there on the other side, and one that's kind of close to the other one. Okay. And there's five petals. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Does it have to be perfect? No. And the line, 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 line. Okay. And the more we practice this, the better. Okay, and then there's petals that are part of another flower over here. One that goes like that. One that's the center of that flower. And one that comes like that. The line. There we go. Okay, that's that side. Now this one has a petal, but it kind of goes behind a leaf, so I'm just going to leave it like that. And one, two, three, four, and five. Now you can make yours whole if that is easier for you. Okay, and back behind here. Runs into that one. Okay, perfect. That's all we need for flowers. It's looking cute. Now, there is a big leaf that comes right here on her forehead. Okay? okay. And it starts about where your flowers are. Okay? And it comes down and it points. Comes down, points back up. And goes behind, remember this flower. And then comes back up and rounds. Okay, and then give it a line in the middle for the veins. There we go. All right, and then there's a stem that comes out from this. It's like that. Two lines that go over to the right with a circle on top. I do a, like a diamond shape. Fantastic. Okay. So there's a leaf right here, and we're just going to do one leaf to make it simple. Do a line, and some veins, okay? And then this is the signature little pixie, looks like a pixie haircut, but it's really leaf. Comes in, goes like this. Points up. Pointy. Okay, and then there's one on the other side as well. But I'm not going to come all the way down because there's another leaf right here. Okay, and I'm just going to simplify that by making it look exactly like the other side. And draw a line right there. So it looks like there's a leaf behind there. And some veins. And this one's some veins. Okay, so we're getting close to having her little head top done. Okay, there's a leaf that comes out over here. And then this one kind of comes out, which is kind of cutey little doo woppy. Doo woppy. A doo woppy. And I think you get the idea with the veins. Great! Alright, now we have to do the little seeds that are in here. Yay. So, the fun of the seeds is that they're kind of random. Alright, some of them are going to start at the side, so it looks like it's three-dimensional. We're not just going to have seeds that look like that. Okay, some of them are going off, and you kind of want to just space them out. You'll notice that they don't go any lower than her eyes. Done. Whoa, you're so fast. Okay, fantastic. Okay, I'm going to color in her shoe. 
and you guys can color her in. Really, that's it. She's got all of her parts there, all of her parts. So this next step is color it the way you want to. guys for creating with us. Please subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and check out these other videos, huh? We'll see you next time. Bye.